When the PS4 launched, Sony was like, we need a good graphics kill zone. So they made Kill Zone Shadowfall. And then the game came out and everybody said, I mean, it is a good graphics kill zone, but it's the next generation of consoles. We were kind of hoping that games would like evolve and be better. Are we really just going to be playing the same game we've been playing for 10 years already for the next and the next after that generation of consoles? And the answer to that question was yes. I'm playing as a child escaping the occupation. This is like a David Cage game what is going on here oh no is the kid gonna get killed and it's so sad like mass effect 3 or is the kid gonna be the main character he'll like grow up and be like when the hell gans killed my dad i swore to become an army guy and kill them back why are there so many papers blowing in the breeze it's not like a post-apocalypse this is like a normal city on a normal night with gunships who ripped out all the pages from every book and tossed them into the sky is that a pilot from titanfall he looks exactly like the pilot guy from Titanfall 2. You're supposed to be in a different dead franchise. Get out of this game. No, father. What's wrong with him? Why is he moving? He got shot by a machine gun. This kid is stupid. If this kid is the main character, we're in trouble. Eight years later, the kid grew up to be an army guy so he could get revenge on the combine. In a world where the rich people have a nice garden on top of the building, but down below, things... <laughs> Things are just a JPEG. A blurry JPEG of a city is down below. Follow the rat way. Oh, God. How many times do I gotta tell Brynjolf that I have, in fact, done an honest day's work for all this coin I'm carrying? Oh, God, it has swiping. Swipe up for the attack mode on the drone. Oh, I hate this. I'm swiping right and it's not doing anything. There we go. It took like six swipes. This is why I hate swipes. Oh, God, I just accidentally super liked that Hellgan soldier. How embarrassing. Any bad guys up here? There's one. I see a bad guy. Kill him. Whew, here we go. 34 minutes into the recording, a Hellgan has been shot. When the red laser pointer goes across the top of the rail. Oh man, it's so good. That single-handedly makes up for the too long intro. Welcome to the next generation of shooters, red laser pointer sniper. Glad to see you weren't left behind. I have a feeling you'll be appearing in games for years to come. We got biohazard symbol. We got the med bay with dead guys. Hellgan, did you guys make those things when I wasn't looking? Did you deploy zombies? Or was it just a bioweapon? If it's just a virus that makes guys die that's kind of a waste like you might as well turn them into zombies while you're at it right why not that's definitely in your scientist wheelhouse as the bad guy faction kill zone <coughs> come closer with my dying act i secured this audio com log for you it cost me my life but the information contained within is absolutely critical. I don't care. Uh, well, here's your problem, Killzone. Your spaceship has a giant window pointed directly at the sun. You want to avoid gazing directly into that at all times. That's how you end up like the elusive man. Oh, hi, lady that was in the trailer. I think you're probably a good guy. No, she, oh, she's red. So she works for the bad guys, but then she learns that the bad guys are bad. And then she'll work for the good guys instead. And maybe they'll fall in love. Hey, lady, are we going to fall in love? Uh, I guess that's a no. Welcome to Blue Guy Industries. Because we are blue, you know we are good guys. Oh, oh, that's, oh no, that's not good. Is this the no Russian of this game? I think it's the no Russian, right? Because like a civilian is there and she got blown up by a bomb. And then this guy is going to shoot her. Yeah, okay. Don't worry, lady. We're going to get out of this. Can I kill civilians myself? Oh, <laughs> you can. <laughs> I got absolutely obliterated. I got bug on the windshielded. Oh no. <laughs> All right, that's enough train level for you, young man. Get back on the gunship. You were enjoying yourself a little bit too much down at the train station. Oh, but come on, general guy. I like the train part. It was fun. No, you can't do the train part. And to teach you a lesson, I'm going to make you kill the train with a minigun. That'll teach you. No more trains allowed. Gunships is the only form of transportation the army guy is allowed to have. Wait a minute. That's a bad guy, but he's wearing a blue costume. Are the blue guys bad guys? Are the bad guys blue guys? Are the good guys bad guys? Are the bad guys good guys? Get out of here, kill zone guy. I'll stab you in the throat through your soldier armor that's made of metal somehow. I'm a shooter guy. When I press R3, anybody in front of me dies. Those are the rules. In the all new Killzone Shadowfall, experience graphics like never before seen on the PlayStation 4. Why is there a floating guy here? It's the E3 demo. Get that guy out of here. We're trying to make people think that the new Killzone is going to be good. You can't have a bug in your trailer like that. People are going to think this is the elevator to V's apartment. Next time you play hide and seek with your friends, try switching things up by adding in stealth takedowns for the people hiding. So the Hellgan citizens are so depressed they don't even care when i kill one of them they're like eh whatever man 
<laughs> we're, we're so destitute, we don't even care if you machine gun us. All I have to my name is this cardboard box that won't sit still. Because I'm leaning against it. I think the physics are interacting weirdly. There you go, box. Now you can sit still. This is a good screenshot right here. Look at this. This is like a screenshot for Star Citizen. If you screenshot this and put it on the Star Citizen Kickstarter page, people would say, wow, the graphics are looking so good in Star Citizen these days. This was a great use of my $300 million investment. Good job, Killzone Shadowfall, for still making me say, hey, it looks pretty good, even though the game's 10 years old. Sorry, evil science lady. Your evil science is gonna come to an end. If I could shoot you, which I can't. It's a point the gun down and talk type cutscene. Dang it, my least favorite. Do I shoot the bad guy or the good guy? Oh, the bad guy shot the good guy. Does that mean that she is a bad guy? Because I thought she was a good guy. I think the scientist was the bad guy. So her killing the scientist bad guy makes her a good guy because she was a bad guy, but she shot the bad guy, which makes her part of the good guy faction. This story is too confusing. I'm going to the Ace Combat 7 space elevator. All right, kill zone. Don't hit the collapsing buildings. Why are all these buildings deciding? to collapse at this exact moment is your mom walking around on the road down there trophy earned the dead the dead what do they I do anything him. in particular do they perhaps vocalize some thoughts kill the bad guy and prove you're a good guy once and for all clip your leg right through his chest Okay, so she killed the bad guy. She killed the bad guy of the whole game. So she's definitely a good guy now. She's firmly in the good guy camp. Eventually, we will win. Not if the Killzone franchise is canceled. Didn't think about that, did you? It is Sting from Dune from Killzone 3. He is the bad guy of this one. They hooked him up to a tube. Well, all we gotta do is unplug him and we win, right? There we go. Oh, it's a good guy. What the? Good guy, what are you doing? You're the good guy. You're the mentor figure. I mean, I know me and mentor were gonna have to fight eventually. I expected me to start the fight though, not him. Cause mentor is like, we should kill the bad guys. And for some reason, my guy's like, no, we shouldn't kill the bad guys. They're friendly, actually. I think one of the girl ones likes me. Sorry, I couldn't be that person. What? He just kills you. What? It's done. It just ends like that? That's a shocking ending. I can't believe the mentor just walks in, kills you when it ends. Oh, hey, 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 there we go. Okay, now we gotta play as a sniper girl and kill that guy, right? Looks like this bad guy that people thought was a good guy is actually a bad good guy the whole time. Hey, look, the bullet is a bionicle canister. I'm shooting this guy with Kopaka. There should probably be more sound during that and maybe the achievement shouldn't pop up before he dies. Okay, now it's over. Now it's really over. They got the classical music credits. That's how you know it's done. Kill Zone Shadow Fall. Everything except for the gameplay is good in this. The graphics are good. The sound is good. The music is good. The gameplay is eh, it's whatever. This game has big red box energy. It's got big blockbuster energy. It's got big turning it back into GameStop after beating it in one day energy. So, Oboe Shoes Games, how did playing Kill Zone Shadow Fall make you feel? 